Hello and welcome to this lecture. In this lecture we will install Blender on Mac OS after downloading it. There is also a lecture for Windows users on how to install Blender on Windows 10, so if you have a PC, you can skip this one and go to that lecture. Now let's first open Safari or another browser if you prefer that. Go to the address bar and type in blender.org. This will open up the Blender homepage where we have a Download Blender 2.82a button and a Download menu. 2.82a could be different because we are recording this, so you could have a newer version. Click on Download in the menu, and on this download page you will see again a button Download Blender 2.82a or another version. It automatically knows what system we are using, so it says Mac OS. There are other versions available as well, but let's ignore that and click on the Download Blender button. This brings us to a thank you page, you are breathtaking. You might get a question from your system asking if you want to download from Blender.org and say allow. Blender will start downloading, you can see that here. It will ask for your attention when done, then quit Safari with Command Q, then go to the download folder by clicking on the icon here and say open in Finder. Here we have the download folder with a .dmg file. Double click on that to open. This is a disk image, so you'll get a virtual disk on your desktop after it's done. You'll probably know this as a Mac user. It opens automatically, and this Blender icon can be dragged into the Applications folder, like so. Now depending on your setup, you might need to authenticate when you copy something to your Applications folder. So fill in your peripherals, username and password. I will skip this part for my own security. And after that, in the Applications folder you will find the Blender application. You can pick that up and drag that into your dock for easy access. Then we can close the application folder, close the disk image folder, then eject the disk image by throwing it on the bin. Let's delete the TMG file. So let's throw it in a bin as well. And if you want, you can then empty your bin. Close the downloads folder. And now open up Blender. You might need to give permission to open it because it's downloaded from the internet. Say open. And here is your freshly installed Blender. That's it for this lecture. I'll see you in the next. Bye bye.